Nah, 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 nah. Yo, this can't be real life. URL, I think this was possibly the worst time, bruh, that y'all could make this type of decision. Y'all in caffeine, bro. This was probably the worst decision that y'all could make, bruh. Right now, in March of 2023, bruh, with Remy Ma and ARP dropping big battles on YouTube, bruh. Remy Ma, ARP, I'm not gonna lie. The battle rap community needs you guys right now more than ever, bruh. More than ever, the battle rap community needs you right now. Why? Because now, URL events are behind a second paywall, bro. Not only are they on the URL TV app where we got to pay, but caffeine used to be free and now we have to pay to watch events on caffeine, bro. Hmm. Let's talk about it. First of all, first of all, first of all, first of all, yo, Averb, if you're not going to battle A Ward, bruh, stop talking about him, bruh. Stop making live after live after live after live talking down on A Ward unless you plan on battling him, bruh. Second of all, yo, I really appreciate you guys because on my previous video, I asked a lot of you guys to hit that like button so my video goes further and more of you guys could view it. And you guys did, bro. I really appreciate that, man. Make sure that you guys do it again and hit that like button, bro. If there's anything of value that I say that you guys appreciate or that makes you guys think in a different perspective or view things in a different light, hit a like on that video. I haven't heard or seen anybody talking about this yet, bro. Third of all, I haven't seen anybody talking about this yet, and I just so happened to come across these news just recently on Facebook, Facebook groups. This is part of the reason that I'm a part of some Facebook groups, because honestly, there'd be some conversations and some, and some things that be talked about there before it surfaces on YouTube and media. For example, Norb's putting out there that the CGs are coming soon, the Chrome Grounds. So I'm thinking he's got something in the works with Remy Ma, you know what I'm saying? To where they're going to be trying to do something and, and, and Norbs might be working with Remy Ma to do something to develop talent. You know what I'm saying? We all know how Norbs is respected and known in the battle rap community for having done just that with URL talent. You know what I'm saying? Scouting and seeking talent and bringing them onto a platform. So information like that be rapidly accessible in Facebook groups, bruh. Now, we know that recently, Remy Ma has been doing it major, along with ARP. Mega event just took place, bruh, between Hitman Holla and Easy to Block Captain. Am I right? Am I right? We witnessed the battle, and then we saw an immediate drop on YouTube, where we saw Hitman Holla get a first shake in front of a New York crowd. Hitman Holla, you got a first shake up there versus Easy to Block Captain. Easy to block Captain ended up being the one having the mic issues, bruh. Not Hitman Holla. You can play it back and see it here for yourself. Anyways, a lot of hype, bruh, around a mega YouTube drop. Why? Because for the past few years, the URL has had battles behind a paywall. URL holds events, right, with some big battles. And they never drop on YouTube for the public and the entirety of Battle Rap to see. They will release the battle sometime a while after the battle occurs on the URLTV.TV app with the expectation that people are going to want to see it so much that they're going to end up subscribing to the URLTV.TV app. So there's been a lot of conversation around YouTube drops and how YouTube drops help the artist specifically gain a lot of exposure. For example, Easy to Block and Hitman Holla just dropped on YouTube. It's at about 750,000 views right now in about two days. Should be at a million very soon, within the week, I'm sure. You know what I'm saying? Exposure 
is one of the major reasons that people are talking about YouTube. You even got people like Jazz the Rapper talking about how she would like YouTube drops and blah, blah, blah. People are talking about YouTube and exposure, bruh. While URL is holding events, right? Right? And then holding on to battles and then releasing the battles onto the URL TV.tv app where you have to pay a subscription fee in order to view the battles. URL, y'all just screwed up though, man, because the battle rap community is already having a hard time accepting this app, right? And the fact that battles take so long to drop, artists deserve more exposure, and a lot of artists don't even want to be stuck behind that app because they want people to be able to see their battles. For example, people are talking about their friends don't even know they battle anymore because their battles are behind an app and not on YouTube. Jazz was just talking about that recently, how people, she was being asked, oh, you still battle? because her battles are behind the paywall on URL TV.TV app, right? URL, this is possibly the worst time that you could have made this decision, bro. There's a reason that when we've been hearing about this Kings and Queens card, we haven't heard Beasley and what he usually says when a caffeine event is about to go down and we haven't seen anywhere, any flyer or anything say live and for free. Y'all look back on any announcement, bruh. Any announcement, any flyer, none of it says live and for free. I remember seeing some people talking about this. Some people questioned it. They were like, why doesn't it say live and for free? How come Beasley, when they, how come they're not saying live and for free like they usually do on Caffeine, right? Because the thing with Caffeine was that we could catch live events, live stream for free, right? That was the whole thing. That was part of the, the big reason that people would even gravitate to Caffeine so that we can catch events live and for free, bruh. Well, as it turns out, bruh, as it turns out, bruh, this upcoming Kings and Queens card is going to be live. Definitely going to be live. But guess what it's not going to be, bruh? And this is on caffeine. It's not going to be free. This event is not going to be free. URL has gone ahead, URL and Caffeine have gone ahead and made it so that now, I don't, I hope this is not the situation moving forward, but if this is happening now, I can imagine that this will be the situation going forward with URL major events on Caffeine. They've made it so that URL events are now behind a second paywall, bro. So now, right, not only do we have to pay for the URL TV.TV app to watch the battle way after it happens, because that's where it's going to be stored, right? Not only do we have to pay the $7.99 for the app so that we can catch battles maybe like a month or two later or even, even more sometimes, but now in order to watch the live stream, you also have to pay caffeine. So y'all remember when everything was live and for free. Well, now it turns out, bruh, Kings versus Queens for March 19th, unlock Kings versus Queens four to watch live on 319, on demand until 326, and get access to one month free subscription to the URL TV.TV app. All sales are final, terms apply. Unlock Kings versus Queens 4, unlock with gold, 250. I don't know what, how much that is or what that translates to because I don't, I don't have it. I've never purchased anything on the caffeine app. But this now means, bruh, that we have not, o not only do we have to pay for the URL TV.TV app, but now we have to pay to watch the event live on caffeine. But one of the biggest things for caffeine was that everything was live and for free. URL, this is possibly one of the worst times, bruh, that y'all could have made this type of mistake, bruh. And yes, this was a mistake. I don't know what happened here or what negotiations occurred in the background or if caffeine feels like they've been taking a loss 
with this whole battle raft thing to the point where now they have to charge and they're charging people to try and recoup money from the battle rap community. I don't know if this might have been the plan the entire time for caffeine to build uh, uh, an audience on the app and on the, the platform to then turn around and try and charge us for a lot. I don't know what's going on, bro. But this is the worst time that you guys could have possibly made this decision. And why is that? Because we got new platforms popping up, bro. Such as Remy Ma's Chrome 23, where I don't know if y'all see what's happening here. But Remy Ma is offering something different to the battle rap community right now. She's offering something completely different to the battle rap community right now. She's not trying to put these... These battles and these things behind paywalls. She's trying to make these things accessible to the battle rap community. While now we turn around and I'm seeing the URL try and make these events less accessible to the battle rap community, bro. And caffeine. Because ultimately it's caffeine right now that you have to pay another fee in order to watch these battles, bro. I don't know if the if the URL and these people think that everybody's made of money or what's going on, bro. But, yo, this type of thing is sucking this thing dry, bro. You know how many less people now are going to be inclined to tune into this event? Do you realize and understand how many people are going to be less inclined, bro, now? Because they have to pay for it to tune into the event. Yes, there's going to be some people that are going to pay for it, of course. Like myself, most likely. But there's going to be so many, bro. This is a mistake because right now, at the same time, we got leagues like chrome 23 and rbe doing what exactly dropping major battles on youtube that are accessible to the entirety bruh of the battle rap community remy ma arp bruh you guys we need you guys now more than ever bruh because it seems as if though the caffeine and url now are making it more difficult and harder to access these events and these battles. Pe so many less people now watch less battles because it's already on the URL TV.TV app. So many less people watch events because they don't even know what caffeine TV.TV is. Now, how many less people are going to be tuning in because now you have to pay on top of it being on a, 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 an app like caffeine that's not as well known as something like YouTube or even Twitch. Now that you have to pay, bro, how many people do you anticipate or expect to be watching this event live, bro? It's officially, I feel like, gone to it being just about trying to capitalize and make as much money as possible from this battle rap ish over at URL and Caffeine. That's what it seems like now, bro. Because let me again make it clear. Not only do we have to pay one price now, which I, I do faithfully every month, $7.99 to the app so I can catch these battles when they drop at some point. But now you got to pay 250 gold on cap, whatever the hell that means, bro. Remy Ma and ARP, we need you guys now more than ever because while URL is trying to put, URL and Caffeine are trying to put more and more battles and things behind paywalls, bro. You guys are holding events and dropping battles on YouTube. You guys are helping give these artists exposure and other opportunities, bruh. And, and offering them a lane to where they're not stuck behind now two paywalls, bruh. Two. So now even less exposure. Any potential exposure that you could have gotten on caffeine, divide that by two now. Divide it by two. Because how many people are actually going to pay now to watch the event? If these events and these battles are going to end up on the URL TV.TV app anyway, at some point down the line, where we already pay $7.99. Hold up. Let me get this straight, though. Let me get this straight, bro. Perspective. I got everything I wanted. There's some extras. I'm just keeping it real. I don't hear nobody talking about this, bro. And I want to let you guys know what's going on now. This is the worst time URL could have made this decision because Remy Ma is out here trying to make big things happen for people. And so is ARP, bro. He just dropped Ill Will vs. Hollow to Dawn on the tube. What are we doing here, bro? 
What are we doing here, bro? One thing that I feel like Caffeine and URL should understand is that a lot of people are gravitating towards convenience. Especially today, in today's age, a lot of people gravitate towards convenience. What's easier for people? What's easier to access? What's more accessible? What's easy? Guess what people log on to every single day faithfully? Places like YouTube. Guess what people don't go faithfully and is not easily accessible? And it, caffeine TV, caffeine.tv.tv, the URL TV.tv app. I don't, I, sometimes, bro, it's, it's hard because I, I feel like people like the URL and caffeine are so caught up with trying to get a bag out of the battle rap community that they're not understanding that they're inadvertently hurting themselves too. Because while, yes, you're going to get some people that are going to pay now to watch this live stream event on caffeine, there's going to be significantly less people who are going to be tuning in and or are going to be interested in tuning in because they have to pay now. It's a, it's like a gift and a cut. You get like, you have to weigh what's going on here, bro. But when people are just so focused and caught up in making a bag and trying to pursue the bag and getting the most you can financially, people are blinded by that, bro. But we got to come to some kind of compromise here, bro. You are only caffeine. Like we got to come to some kind of compromise here, bro. You guys can't keep trying to suck money and life out of this battle rap ish, bro. This is now another paywall, bro. I don't, I don't think people understand how major this is. I don't think people, yo, yo. This is not going to be my first blog on this situation. This is just to let y'all know what's going on. I'm still going to tap in. But I know for a fact that there's going to be a lot of people now that are not. And I hope you are only caffeine understand this. And Remy Ma and ARP, I hope y'all understand what's going on. Another paywall, making it harder to access battles. So now I feel like y'all have a, a clear lane in battle rap. Y'all have... A clear lane to dominate battle rap now because if y'all are holding events and uploading battles to YouTube where everything is accessible and y'all giving these battlers opportunities while URL is putting stuff behind multiple paywalls bro it'll be not long at all before Chrome 23 and RBE are officially officially bigger than URL officially <laughs> nah, bro. We can't be doing this. Let me know what y'all are thinking about this, man. You already know what it is. It's your boy Joe coming at you live and direct from the battle. <laughs>